Hey guys, Mariah from MariahMagazine.com here. Um, in this quick video, I am just going to show you how to grab your Facebook pixel from your Facebook business page and install it onto your Squarespace website. So the first thing you want to do is grab your pixel. So you go to your business Facebook page and then you have to go to the business manager and then we're going to click where it says pages right here in the top left hand corner and then we're going to click the pixels option. So if you haven't created a pixel yet, go ahead and create one. Um, I'm not going to run through that on this tutorial, but once you create it, you'll be shown your pixel right here. So we're going to go ahead and click on the pixel that we've created. And then we're going to go to the setup button right here. So once you click setup, you have these three options right here. If you would like, you can email instructions to a developer. So if you have somebody that works on your website with you or for you, you can go ahead and click that option and you can email them these directions. But the option that we're going to work with today is the middle one. So manually install the code yourself. So once you click on that, you're going to copy the entire pixel code and paste it into your website header. Okay, so I know that this sounds and looks a little uh, overwhelming, but we're just going to copy the code to the clipboard so that we have it saved. And then we're going to go to our Squarespace website. So squarespace.com and then go ahead and log into your site. And once you're logged in, you're going to come down to settings. So click on that. And then we're going to scroll down to advanced. And then we're going to click code injection. Now, just be aware that this is a premium feature, so it's not available on the personal plans for Squarespace, but it is available on business and e-commerce plans. So what we're going to do, since we have that um, code copied into our clipboard, we're just going to paste it right there, and we're going to click save. And that's it. So now your Facebook code will be injected into every single page on your website. So you can get super in depth and like advance with the Facebook pixel codes and kind of inject them into like different pages and things like that, depending on exactly what you're doing with it. But this tutorial just shows you how to do the basics. And if you want to find out if you installed your Facebook pixel correctly on your website, um, you can download this free Chrome extension. It's called Facebook Pixel Helper. Um, I'll leave the URL to it down below in the description. So basically you click on that and then click add to Chrome and then you're going to want to add the extension. And then once you do that, you'll see this cute little notification here and we can just close that out. So once you have it installed, you can go ahead and visit your website. And if the Facebook pixel is installed correctly, you'll see this green little box next to your Chrome extension. So if you click on it, it says one pixel found. And then it gives you a little bit more information on the pixel itself. But if it's not installed properly, then you you won't see that green box right there. And you'll see that no pixels found, which means that you either didn't put it into the right area or the right header script. Um, there could be a few reasons for that. But this free Google Chrome extension is super helpful so that you can see if you you installed the pixel correctly just at a quick glance so if you guys have any questions about this tutorial just go ahead and pop them in the comments below and I would love to help you out and if you found this tutorial helpful just go ahead and give it two thumbs up for me